Good afternoon, Brony Nation. My name is Mo Luminous or Faith, whatever you wish to call me. And guess what? The Hub. Yes, The Hub. The show that hosts our favorite shows and all kinds of other stuff. Recently born is apparently being cut right in, right in its birth, really. Uh, it hasn't even had a chance to spread its wings and fly. You know most networks have that giant debt. The Hub is $300 million in debt right now uh, from the startup costs. Apparently, Discovery has just decided to split from The Hub, but in a way that still gives them controlling interest of the channel and will become the Discovery Family Network. Yes, the hub will be no longer. Hasbro, however, will still contain about six hours of content every day from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m., which typically means our show MOP will be fine. However, however, in the future, this could also mean that the hub will sell, or rather Hasbro will sell, at least the ability to show uh, some of their shows to something like Cartoon Network. Uh, this would make it more widely available to a lot of people. However, Cartoon Network has had a history of over-censoring certain elements and shows, such as Naruto and various other shows that have been ported to there. Since this is still an American-slash-Canadian-based show, there's not going to be any over-localization, such as calling rice balls cheeseburgers or anything of that nature, but there still won't be the same exact elements that we're used to. Now, I don't know if everyone understands the implications of a network failing, but that's what this is. Uh, to better emphasize what this really means, think of Cartoon Network. Cartoon Network has Cartoon Network during the day, and then Adult Swim at night. Same channel, but two completely different content streams. The Hub and Discovery Family Network will be kind of like that, with the Hub being Adult Swim, and the Discovery Family Network being Cartoon Network. Except instead of at night, it's going to be in the morning to about when kids get home. I don't know if you guys realize that, but that's prime time around that 2.30 to 3.30 3 like time frame. That's when people are just getting out of school. So actually, they probably are retaining some revenue, but not as much. I mean, I personally didn't find the hub to be interesting except for one show, obviously, but they still have to make a profit. <laughs> they have to pay back those debts. So whether or not this means that our show may be ported to Cartoon Network Disney or any other kind of channel, we don't really know yet. All we know is that, oh, DHX has, or Discovery Family Network has decided to split as early as the fourth quarter, which could be uh, next month, is what I'm being told. So, I'll try to keep you guys updated. If you guys don't know, uh, you know, this was on Equestria Daily. Links down in the description to the article itself. There's not a lot of information floating around, but yeah. As always, have been Malimnus. It's been a pleasure. Peace and limb out. Hope you guys comment, rate, and subscribe. Do have a Patreon. I'm trying to get to the articles. I'm contacting people as best as I can. But, you know, these are CEOs of companies. They're not exactly super easy to get in touch with. Um, I don't know how this also affects... I, I don't think this will affect us too much. At least not in the first few months. So, don't worry too much. Uh, but, yeah. Uh, I'll definitely keep you guys posted, definitely keep your noses to uh, EQD and see what happens on there. Uh, I'll try to keep the information flowing as soon as it happens. But yeah, be sure to comment your thoughts. What do you think is going to happen? What do you think this means? Would you like to see our show ported to something like Cartoon Network, Nickelodeon, Disney, something like that?